The problem that I have found with these platforms, and I've been looking at them quite a lot because I study uh, complex systems theory, and the role of these platforms within sort of social networks and systems, is that the moment you input something digitally onto an online platform, it's too easy to lose the human uh, elements of that and also the nuances which comes from real life engagement and human contact. So if you were to look at OpenDesk, which is a fantastic online platform for sharing Creative Commons designs for digital fabrication. The idea is that you share designs globally so that you can make locally. And I think that's a beautiful idea, but what it lacks is those interesting kind of unpredictable nuances that happens when a person downloads a file and then they go off screen into the real world, into the workshop, and all of a sudden they tweak something by a millimeter or they twist a joint or they speak to the client and she says, well, it's for my husband and he has a medical condition and this is... Those day-to-day -day challenges and transformations are, on, on, are, are often the seeds of the most interesting and innovative approaches to, to problem solving, to design thinking, to fabrication. And I've found it quite difficult to translate those tiny little moments in time to an online platform because you lose that granularity and you lose that detail. Um, so in thinking about what these platforms could be in the future, I would hope that they would grow and, and become sophisticated enough so that they could manage and disseminate the complexity of everyday making.